With me is the man, the myth, the legend, the chief beach boy exposer. <laughs> Johnny Alpo. <laughs> it is the dream of every traveler to escape the comfort zone. It is the dream of every traveler to be away from the norm, to be away from everyone. And uh, that's why in many occasions you will be you will see many travelers all the flies going to some beautiful and lonely islands yeah meanwhile before i continue we have a ship there so we that shows you what is it can you see it yeah there is a ship at the farthest end so every traveler would want to do what no one else is doing every traveler we like being associated with some funny characters, you know. I'm not insulting anyone, but that's true. And a traveler won't like um, eight to five job, won't like working always. But whenever they pushing their own brand, they showcasing what they do. They always give it 100%. So that's us. That's the life of travelers so the water has already moved to the deep sea there we have a boat with the name mafofoni mafofoni that's the name of the boat then it has a flag on it i think we have some two other boats there so the boats are numbered this is mv mafofoni uh the flag then number one that's the boat number one probably the government provided this i can see the coat of arms for this country then um some other logos many of these guys were funded probably that's the board for uh rescue just in case we have someone stuck at the indian ocean in case um they got swept by the waters by the waves so my name is go see africa just in case you're watching me for the first time I'm a traveler and a YouTuber from Kenya, Africa. I'm at Shelly Beach and uh, I wanted to show you what's happening. Kijana, Mambo. I wanted to show you what's happening around. Let's let get to see. Look at these crystal waters of Shelly Beach. Yeah. Crystal waters. The waters are very salty, so the kind of fish we have around are the likes of tuna, the mud fish. Those fish only found in salty waters. We can't find tilapia here. Maybe the other kind of sheep, uh, the other kind of uh, fish we have here are the sharks and whales. Is whale a fish? Leave a comment. I think whale is a mammal. How does it feed its young ones at the water? Let, let's have a discussion with it. We need to have a discussion. So I'm at the beach. We are waiting for the water to come back to the shores. It has already moved to the deep sea. And uh Getting there, it's restricted. We have some specialists, some guys who, call, who refer themselves as specialists. Yeah. The seamen, those guys who have dedicated their whole life to fishing. So they proceeded there. So I had a request that I wanted to accompany them, but they, know, they, they told me no. Even if you know how to swim, it's a no. We are the only people allowed to be there. Your safety is important, so you are not going there. I felt offended. They saw me young and uh, incompetent to be with them. But the reality is, it's risky. The reality is, they, they are so much caring. They never wanted me to, uh, to end there and probably come up with pneumonia or something. Those guys were, were dressed heavy. I don't know. Leave a comment, guys. When these guys are going to the deep sea, they dress warm. 
from their leg to the top. I don't know the signs behind that, but according to them, it's very cold. I expected them to be on shorts and a vest. Yeah, I I expected them to be very casual, very light, on very light clothes, but it was different. Yeah. So look at the coral reefs. These are coral reefs, and if you're not careful, it can easily cut your your leg. It can easily harm you. It can harm you very easy. Wow, very clear waters. Ideally, Mombasa has always been my relaxing spot. Anytime I want to have a good time, I want to have my me time, I like coming here. I'm that one kind of a person who can just camp here without interacting with no one and still have my best time. So long as my camera is on. <laughs> yeah, my subscribers always win. I have a very good attachment with my viewers, my subscribers, so the priority is on you guys. The best gift you can gift yourself at the beach is having your name imprinted on the white sun. So go see Africa. Wow, that's beautiful. So I'm still at the beach and I'm uh, going to go to the beach. Oh no? This is Pilau. Yeah, Pilau. Life at the coast. Tamu sana. Some good stuff. Local made. This passion. Passion food, yeah. Then we have the nice inside. Say nice or ice? Ice frozen. It's a weekend and you can tell by the population at the beach. So the water just coming uh, to the seaside, to the seashore. Yeah, you can tell. Look at how the place is so populated. Very populated. And uh, most unfortunate thing is that these guys are playing um, copyrighted music so I might not get time to interact with them yeah and you know at the coast they ban the use of cards because of over drug overuse but these guys have even gone to the extent of branding uh, uh, those bags you pull cut you can't tell whether it's tea or it's cut <laughs> I like this. I like the creativity with Africans. I, you know, uh, classical theory by Sarah Beccaria. Every human being has the free will to, to do as they wish. So they consider um, pay, pleasure in relation to pain. When pleasure exists pain, then you choose to go with the pleasure. What makes you happy? <laughs> with me, is the man, the myth, the legend, the chief beach boy exposer, <laughs> Johnny Alpo. <laughs> so this guy is doing a good job at the beach, exposing the beach boys. You know, this character we really don't like it. I told you, you try to imagine having your woman at the beach. Someone snatches your woman, take them to the deep sea, then they do whatever they they doing there. Then you know what? Because of the fear of shame what the child is going to say something happens then our ladies never come back to say to disclose what really happened or they never go to the uh, police station in fear of stigmatization you know this guy is doing a good job and uh, i can tell the beach is not clean some are clean <laughs> some are clean some are very clean <laughs> You, you need to subscribe to his channel. By the way, Jonyabo. Check him out. J O N A Y J O N Y A B O. Yeah, exactly. Yes. Check him out. Check what he's doing. Comment there. 
tell him that you are you are sent to his channel by Coast Africa. Look, let, let's do this. Dude. He's the one who motivated me to uh, keep on doing what we do at times when I come to Mombasa, you know. But yeah, do these guys know you? Whether you the one doing it, they don't know you. Right? Some uh, men of them don't do it. But, but, uh, though in most cases, but you, anybody you, can do these things. But you don't show your face. I don't. I don't, yeah, I don't, I don't like it. I don't so like it. It's a mistake I'm showing him. <laughs> I'm ah, showing no his problem. face. But, <laughs> <laughs> but, but uh, the, the previous videos, eh? uh -huh. the first videos. The first videos you used to show ah, your yes, face. Because ah, yes, yes. uh, I, I used to see you uh, walk vlogging, then uh, all of a sudden you are at the beach. Yes. Wow. So I decided that uh, let me change tactics a little bit mm -hmm. so that uh, at least uh, I'm, not, <laughs> I'm not known by anybody yeah you don't become a target it is what it is <laughs> but we, it's okay we are at the Shelly beach so just in case uh, we identify any funny character we are going to show you we are going to display it to you so keep on subscribing like the video yeah and share the link with your friends but the problem today like there's no maybe the, the way no, uh, yeah the water is just shallow. come. Yeah, it's shallow. And yeah. That's why guys are not here. Yeah. Uh, though we have some few people approaching, some yeah, people yeah. are coming. Let's hope. Uh, I want to find something. Yeah, let's hope so. Let's wait. Yeah. Look, what's happening? The tides are being heavy. And you know that this water will uh, accumulate at this, this point. It will move up here where we have these guys so and i don't know why i'm so much attracted to the beach and the life of the coast i don't know why i really can't tell so it's about <laughs> it's about sunset so I told you the ties are a bit rough. I need to be careful while walking on the shores. Very careful. Go see Africa. So I need to be very careful while at the shores. So those um, are coral reefs. They know the usual stones you used to. Then our boats are there. Some guys still swimming. Cool evening breeze. That's see some coconut trees. The place is so windy. You can see my 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 shirt is being blown away. Then the waves are still uh, advancing gradually. Then let me tell you something about our beaches. The sand is so white, very white. So it's so unique. Unlike where you are, and that gives you a reason as why you need to visit Africa, you need to visit Kenya. In Lana by now they've already exited the waters. 